In this video, I will compare Pro Writing Aid versus Grammarly and tell you which of these tools may be best for you and your needs. So they are both tools that basically help you improve your writing, make it easier to read and remove any spelling mistakes. For example, if you're just learning a language, it can be very helpful. Or even if you're native in a language, sometimes you will make a typing mistake and they will just help you fix that. And that is something that they both do. Now, Pro Writing Aid is pretty different compared to Grammarly. You can see Pro Writing Aid's features. They have a grammar checker. You can rephrase stuff. They have a paraphrasing tool, a critique report, AI sparks, and writing reports. If you click all features, you will see an overview of everything included in Aid. So, for example, rephrasing your writing with ease is very simple. You just select it with your mouse and then click rephrase. Now, in terms of the AI Sparks, which is one of the features, you can see it helps you generate writing ideas, improve readability and save time. <clears throat> and you can see an example of that right here. So this is how Pro Writing Aid implements AI. Now, Grammarly also has very strong AI features. It's a responsible AI that ensures your writing and reputation shine. So in terms of the products, you can see their features right here. So their features include paragraph rewrite, which is similar to the rephrasing feature on Pro Writing Aid. Now you also have a strategic coach, which will help you anticipate your reader's questions and answer them. Then you have clarity, which will help you be understood the first time. It does proofreading. So basically it shows you any improvements that you may be able to make and it shows you tone suggestions. For example, it can help you be more confident or maybe nicer whatever tone you want it to be. Now it can also paraphrase, compose, it can create quick replies to emails and there are app shortcuts. Now both of these tools can be added as Chrome extensions and can be used on different apps. So you can see AI features wherever you write and it works across 500,000 plus apps such as Notion, Gmail, Microsoft PowerPoint, Slack, Figma, Facebook and hundreds of thousands of different apps. Now, Pro Writing Aid also works in a bunch of different apps, such as also Notion, Chrome, on Apple, in your notes, on Gmail, and a lot more. Now, in terms of pricing, you can see Pro Writing Aid has a free plan available. And what I like a lot about Pro Writing Aid is that you have lifetime plans, which means you can just do a one time payment to use it forever. And then after that, you will just not be billed again. Now, for example, the premium pro plan, if you pay monthly, is 36 euros per month, where you get 50 AI sparks per day and three critiques per day. And you can see the free plan is also pretty decent and the premium plan at 30 euros per month, which is not that much less compared to premium pro, will get you five AI sparks compared to 50 on the pro plan. Now, if you bill yearly, then it goes to 10 euros per month for the premium plan and 12 for the premium pro plan. And lifetime is 399 for premium and 699 for premium pro. So here it is a huge difference, but with monthly and yearly, it isn't. So that is something to bear in mind. Now, when you compare this to Grammarly's pricing, you will see they also have a free plan available. And this will help you write without mistakes, see your writing tone and generate text with 100 AI prompts. Now this is for individuals, then the 12 euro per month pro plan or 30 euros when you bill monthly is for individuals or teams. And this will help you rewrite full sentences, adjust your writing tone. So here you can just see your writing tone here. You can adjust it with AI. You can stay on brand, write fluently in English, catch accidental plagiarism and generate text with over 2000 AI prompts. Then the enterprise plan for larger organizations has custom pricing. So should you pick Pro Writing Aid or Grammarly? First, I would choose Grammarly if you want to do any of the following. Work in a less cluttered interface. So the cleanest interface will be found in Grammarly in my opinion. Also, if you want to generate more and better AI content, and if you want to integrate with more apps, including mobile apps. So that's when I would use Grammarly. Now, Pro Writing Aid, I would use if you want to analyze more comprehensive writing reports. Then I would also use Pro Writing Aid to take advantage of better pricing options, including the lifetime deals and also student discounts. So you can see here, what if I'm a student or teacher? 
and here you can click providing aid for education and you will get a discount. Our goal is to provide our writing assistant free of charge to over 3000 schools. So you can apply for that. And finally, I would go with Pro Writing Aid if you want to receive more granular and rigorous suggestions. So if you want to create a lot of AI content, I would go with Grammarly. And if you want to analyze more comprehensive writing reports, or you're looking for a cheaper option, or maybe more affordable on the long term, then I would go with Pro Writing Aid. So that concludes this comparison between Pro Writing Aid versus Grammarly. If this comparison was helpful, please consider leaving a like and subscribing to my channel. With that being said, I will see you in the next video.